Um, Shella! Shella, start telling me about your awesome thing of the week as I look for the battery that fell out of this. <laughs> so mine is Logitech has released a whiteboard camera that I thought was interesting because it can hide the presenter. So <clears throat> as the return to the office may be imminent for many, um, others may be still, you know, in, in states where the, there's no, no return to the office or some people may be just working remote indefinitely. Um, if you've ever tried to be on a camera or not be on a camera while you're drawing on a normal everyday whiteboard. Mm -hmm. um, you obviously get this weird point of view where you're like trying to stand to the side of what you're writing so people can see it or drawing, but also be able to, you know, obviously have the pen on the whiteboard. This Logitech um, whiteboard camera mounts above the individual um and obviously captures kind of in front of where the person would be writing and it also will try to digitally remove them from the video feed oh cool so so you think of like if you the picture shows someone you know drawing at the whiteboard and then has an image up on the screen of what is on the whiteboard but the person's arm has been removed the um Hmm. I'm guessing it's kind of doing it's, it's looking at what was there before the hand entered the equation. And then as it leaves, and I'm sure things may pop up um, as it ga gathers more information um, from the whiteboard. But it, what it, what's interesting to me is the device, while it may seem pricey, uh, $1,200 for the, the camera and the setup, um, they do promise to work with Zoom. Um, and then shortly after launch, Microsoft Teams, um, twelve hundred dollars may seem steep for a webcam, and this can actually be used for just everyday webcaming. Um, the removing the person from the equation, and, and if you think of the alternative mm -hmm. of what you may, I mean, when you think of the the multi thousand dollar large touch screen hanging on the wall that also has to plug in a computer to it to make everything come together this is a little this is much lower cost than the typical you know touch panel would be even combining the tv hanging on on the wall with the whiteboard and camera i um, mean you're probably below your average multiple 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 thousand dollar large touch screen so pretty cool tech um especially as people potentially are going to um you returning to the office, it also can do things like detect post-it notes. It will tweak the color of marketers, marker markings on the whiteboard to make it more legible or readable um, to those remote. So pretty cool tech from coming out from Logitech. And obviously I think they always do a great job with their, with their video kit. So pretty cool. Excellent. So I, I kept dropping stuff. I apologize. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> Heck of a time tonight. Um, but no, that looks really cool though. Um, yeah, no, I, I like, I like, so, and again, we're talking, yeah, like I said, the $1,200 camera, that's, that's, that's for a corporate situation, right? Like where you're going to, you know, like if you, you're living in Zoom meetings these days, right? Like uh, that, that, mm -hmm. that seems like the, the obvious thing. And, and, and I was amazed how many times I started seeing as we were doing um, conferences and visits and things like that, where we would find the uh, giant, what were they? The, the the giant Microsoft Surface like big, Surface hubs. The, were they the hubs? Like the big like it was a just a giant Surface Windows computer, but it was all touchscreen and drawing on it, and 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 that like the pen thing and everything, and you could do the conference on it. And these things were like had been like fifty inches minimum, if not bigger. Um, so like I I've seen those in a couple of places, you know, around town here. Uh, so I mean they're getting out there, and again places where they, they have a budget for the uh, the office situation, right? So I mean this isn't for uh, my little studio <laughs> to get probably. But when you think about it, I mean let's just pretend, right? Yeah, I, I would. Let's I pretend I have a budget <laughs> for the. I wouldn't view the this type of camera for like the high enterprise high end room. Maybe for like the smaller meeting room. Yeah. 
but when you think about so the the surface hub i mean for the larger one of those you're talking over 20k yeah 20 twenty thousand dollars for a windows computer for a for a for a giant touch screen windows computer um when you look at this i mean this to me gets into the realm of you know maybe students maybe some schools aren't returning or they're you know some kids are staying at home to be able to give the teacher the whiteboard um but make it where it's legible right, <clears throat> right. to the uh, that's the the smaller 2s yeah i think comes in at nine grand i was looking at yeah. the 85 yeah, yeah, was, so, so I, yeah i just pulled up like whatever the first surface <laughs> thing was and yeah it looks like it's like a uh, it, it starts at nine grand but i mean like i i feel like if you're going to get the full and that's the one that's like the flat panel that will just hang on the wall like the ones i saw were like definitely like first gen ones that had a lot of hardware around them right? around it so yeah yeah so it, um, it, it feels like the fold out tv kind of situation a little bit but i think even in the even in the you know school systems i i think this is a viable option potentially mm -hmm. and i'm sure there's some kind of educational discount absolutely absolutely as well speaking of